Hello, welcome to this re review of Absolute Mango Mule Ready to Drink with Mango and Ginger flavor. It's a sparkling ready to drink uh, product. It's made with Absolute Original Vodka and Natural Flavors. And if you get on the website, there's two other flavors. One is 10, one is 7. This is 7.5%. Oh, 7%, sorry. Um, vodka with natural flavors and colored with apple juice and hibiscus juice. All right, so all natural. Uh, they talk about on the website how they developed it with um, in conjunction with bartenders that they work with and help them get these flavors right and everything. It's a product of Canada, although Absolute Vodka is from Sweden. So, uh, imported into New York City, New York. Enjoy chilled straight from the can. I had it in the freezer for a uh, good 25 minutes. Or if you're feeling fancy, which I'm not, serve in a cocktail glass with gar garnish. So, nice, um, colorful label. I bought this at um, a Chevron gas station on Louisiana Highway 44, right along the Mississippi River. Um, they had two for five dollars so I bought one um, I bought this and then I bought the um, oh the uh, Monaco Monaco Tropic Rush yeah so the guy said yeah you can mix them and so it was five so I think I'm going to go back one day soon and try to see if they got the other two flavors now remember they got three flavors listed on the website a lot of these companies might list three flavors but actually have five of them available so got to keep that in mind don't know when these hit the market they don't say on the website I know absolute vodka was introduced 41 years ago as of this year 2020 it was introduced worldwide in 1979 although the company goes back to the 18 70s I believe 1879 um, it was a long complicated history I don't want to get into all that but absolute brand the absolute brand vodka uh, 1979 very popular around the world we all know that it's got a yellowish gray appearance very similar to the um, flavored malt beverages that or the flavored vodkas flavored rum gin brandy uh, products that aren't treated with food coloring okay they'll have this yellowish gray appearance which is why they often treat them with the food coloring to give it more of like a raspberry color or a grape color and that kind of thing hmm. smells nice it smells like bright citrus juice of some sort no nothing like I wouldn't say mango but just a bright citrus juice and that's about it um, like a punch cocktail let's go with the taste and there is one other video review recorded earlier this year and I haven't watched it yet don't know anything about the channel or the review okay this is in the same vein as the Monaco skinny can aluminum can 12 ounce can two for five bucks the monaco usually run about nine percent alcohol this is seven but there is a ten percent like i said that i think it's a raspberry but um now i'm even more curious to go get them don't really feel like driving all the way over there though today might though very sugary sweet only uh sugar no high fructose corn syrup, no flim flam, funny business, humbug stuff, no humbug, just uh, juice, sugar, absolute vodka, which I've never tried. I've done some vodka reviews, wasn't really thrilled with vodka, not an anti-vodka. You can make a channel dedicated to vodka tasting and reviewing and only do vodka and flavored vodka that, like these things, you'd have pretty quickly thousands and thousands of subscribers and views for each video because it's such a huge segment of the of the drinking world you know, you'd never run out of content no way
impossible. Cheap, mid-price, expensive, super expensive. Oh yeah, you just wouldn't run out of content. No way. I jump around, beer, wine, liquor of all sorts, but um, if you are just, let's say you're just interested in one thing, gin, maybe say, I just like gin. My daughter has it. I like gin. That's all I want to really talk about. Well, just stick to that. Don't feel pressured to, to branch out. And it could be a whole exciting world. It, it just would never stop. You could have your own group on Facebook and it, it just would go on and on. It would be an un, unlimited amount, amount of content, essentially. Yeah, you'd never run out. No way. So think about that if you're starting a channel. Sugary sweet, boy. Woo. Not not too not too sweet, not overdone. I think they really perfected it. Um, if I was looking to drink this kind of thing, I wouldn't be looking to drink it. But if I was looking to drink a pre-mixed, ready, what they call RTD, ready to drink cane cocktail, sometimes they're bottled, for sure. Um, but generally they're can, just more convenient, I guess. Um, this would absolutely be one of the, the go-to's qualities there. What are the off flavors, off aromas? There aren't aren't any. Light to medium body, it's light to medium, 7%. I wouldn't drink too many. I don't think you would drink too many though because it's just so sugary. You'll probably, after two, you'd say, oh, no, that's enough. It's a semi-sweet finish. It's like perfect, you know. Absolute is pretty well regarded from what I can understand. People like their regular product. And then they've got the gourmet brands. If you look on their website, it, it, there's a lot more ex really expensive things that they make. You have to lay down some big bucks, but then the payoff probably be there, so it'd be worth it. This one, you're not laying down. You know, 250 a can. If you get the multi packs, like a 12 pack, probably be cheaper than that. A lot of these convenience stores, that's what they're doing. They're buying the multi-packs and breaking them open. Selling the singles, charge, upcharging it. But that's the whole convenience store concept. You're paying for the convenience, right? So it's an A all the way. It's, there's no, no argument. But you better be ready for some sweet, really sugary, sweet um, citrus flavor, which I think a lot of viewers are ready for at all times pretty much so yeah, it's a 96 out of 100 I would say 96 you say why not 100 if it's perfect hey maybe it could be even even more perfect right like they say we're gonna create a more perfect union <laughs> so maybe even a more perfect ready to drink cane cocktail so laissez les bon temps relay a most excellent drink and I'm gonna end this review by saying, y'all come on down to southeastern Louisiana.